Hey everyone, so I just wanted to do this short video clip to show you guys um, a little of what Russian tortoises do when they get ready for bromation. So as you can see from my yard, uh, you know, the grass has started to dry up and there are leaves scattered about. Um, so we are in the middle of October right now and uh, where I am currently is starting to get a little bit cold. It's still, um, you, you know, that the, the weather and the temperature is still nice it's still in the high 70s but it's definitely uh getting cooler um and next week is supposed to be like the low 70s and high 60s so russian tortoises they also know how to um you know prepare themselves for bromation based on the weather and based on the temperature and you'll notice this especially if you keep your tortoises outside so if you keep your russian tortoises in an outside enclosure or even if you just let them have free range of a yard a fenced in yard like i do um they will definitely know uh you know what to do naturally you'll notice that like the weeks leading up uh, tubermation, they'll stop eating. And that's because they are naturally trying to get rid of the waste in their body so that they prepare the, um, themselves for bromation. So one of my tortoises, he's actually pretty further, <laughs> he's further down there. There he is. And uh, so he's dug himself a little bit deeper. I'm just going to like recover them up with the soil. Um, and, you know, their burrows it could be as deep as like six feet. Russian tortoises, they know how for, uh, how far down they need to dig, you know. They'll get to the point where the ground no longer freezes and, uh, you know, they, there's no longer any concerns about freezing. Or, or you could put them in like a huge planter like this and put it in like a garage or something.